As a fan of the Edmonton Oilers, there are a few things that I've become accustomed to. Having a lot of free time in the spring, draft lottery jokes, and seeing players who I couldn't wait for the team to get rid of becoming very successful once they left Edmonton. So it feels kind of strange that for the first time since probably bringing in Curtis Glencross back in 2008, the Oilers have actually added a player that's having more success in Edmonton than he did with his previous team. To say that Patrick Maroon has had a major impact, major impact on the Oilers would be an understatement. And I'm not just talking about the fact that he has four points in three games, even though that's great. As soon as the Oilers made the trade for Maroon, I said to a few of my friends, Maroon is much more valuable on the Oilers than he was with Anaheim. See, because Anaheim already has a lot of size in their forward group. But in Edmonton, Maroon helps to fill a glaring need. The physicality and intimidation he has brought has completely changed the dynamic of the team. After years of watching all the Smurfs on the Oilers get ragdolled, I couldn't believe what I was seeing against Philadelphia, and again against Columbus, and again against Winnipeg. Remember back between Christmas and New Year's, the Oilers played the Flames, and little Sam Bennett was running around, hitting guys left, right, and center, and there was no response from the Oilers. Peter Shirelli must have lost a lot of sleep that night thinking about how a guy who couldn't do one pull-up at the NHL Combine was physically dominating his team. Now, don't get me wrong, I like Sam Bennett, and I understand he had a shoulder injury, and that's why he didn't pass some of the physical fitness tests. But the point is, to have a player with a perceived lack of strength playing against your team and running their show wouldn't sit well with the GM, especially Peter Shirelli. Shirelli clearly didn't like what he saw because since then he has acquired 6 foot 3 217 pound Zach Cassian, 6 foot 4 227 pound Adam Party, 6 foot 2 210 pound Adam Cracknell and 6 foot 3 230 pound Patrick Maroon. I can already tell this guy is going to be one of my favorite Oilers in no time. First of all, anyone who can grow a beard like this is okay in my books. Secondly, Maroon took a number that I thought would be forever tainted and turned it into something to be proud of again. And thirdly, this guy has the cojones to take on the two biggest players on the other team at the same time. I love it. The big rig's here, people, and the Oilers are going to be a heck of a lot harder to play against from now on. I'll see you next week.